What's up guys, morning. Um, here, Pompano. If you're looking for a good spot to launch out of Pompano, this is a uh, 16th Street. Um, I'm here pretty early, but this building is called Tiffany Gardens. If you need help looking it up, you're allowed to launch a kayak here and it's pretty easy launch. You do have to pay to park, but I don't think you have to start paying until six or seven o'clock. Um, I'm here early though, it's like 3.30. I wanna get here early, catch extra bait. Um, actually, you can see the lighthouse over here. That's how, that's how close we are to the lighthouse. See the light? Whew. Woo! What's up guys? Oh, let's see. Already at 109 feet. Sun's just coming up. I got about five gogs. Woo! Put my first one out. But I'm working a lot of big fish on the bottom, so I'm gonna put a downrigger on it. Downrigger is just a. Oh, oh. That was a bite. See? Take it, take it, take it. There we go. Oh, boy. Yeah, I just lose it. Whatever it is took off as was not fighting right now. I wonder what the hell that could be. There we go. Woo. Maybe a small king. Hooked up. What is it? I don't know. Woo! As soon as the sun came up, guys. Oh, what the hell is it? Oh, kingfish. <laughs> nice, nice size one. Nothing like a good slimer to start your day. Woo! Oh man, I'm completely wrong. Barracuda. Big stinky barracuda. Can you hear me? Guys, this guy is feisty. I really don't even want to mess with them, but let me see if I can get that hook out. Get too slimy, guys. Oh, fuck. He smells so bad, but he's a big one. Show them teeth off. Woo! Just hooked up while I was rigging up my jig. 200 feet of water. Oh my god, my heart dropped though. <laughs> There's a giant sea turtle and he just bumped my kayak. The same time my freaking line started going off. 200 feet of water. He thought it was another sea turtle. <laughs> my heart dropped. Hey guys, hook back up, 210. Oh man, it's getting sharked. Ah, he's way too fast for a shark. I'm trying to do the guessing game today and it's not working, so I just want to see what it is. 
What do you guys think it is? That line is tight. Big kingfish, wahoo, big tuna. Hopefully it doesn't spool me, oh my god. Really gotta put the pressure on this freaking guy. Friggin' bait just got cut in half. I just threw another gog out. Just got smoked. But then I lost it after like two seconds. Oh man. You know, I might still have him. I still got him. <laughs> Weird how sometimes they just sit there. I wonder if it's another Cuda then. Another Barracuda. <laughs> oh, that guy bit half my frickin' gog in half. Just feeding the barracudas today. It's always the last bait that's always so lively. <laughs> Yo, if this doesn't get smoked in five minutes. Thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna troll uh, Sabiki on the way back in, see if I can catch more bait, but I already ran out of bait. It's been about two hours. I went through five gogs. Um, two of them, which was barracudas, <laughs> which sucks, but I'd rather catch barracuda than nothing. And I lost two bigger fish, and the other one got cut in half. And it happens out here. It's nice. The weather's perfect. Um, if I catch a couple blue runners on the way in, this video is going to keep going. If not, thank you guys for watching. Uh, thanks for all the new subscribers too. I haven't been fishing. I've been working a lot, like 60 hour weeks. So finally I'm able to get out. And I think this summer I'm just going to try to do as much offshore fishing as possible. It's one of my favorite things to do in the kayak. So, whoo!